Sir Thomas Buxton said, You know the value of prayer. It is precious beyond all price. Never, never neglect it. This is Daniel White the Third with the Prayer Motivator Minute number 481, here to remind you that there is still great power in prayer to God Almighty. Our prayer motivator verse from the Word of God today is Jonah 2.7, which reads, When my soul fainted within me, I remembered the Lord, and my prayer came in unto thee, into thine holy temple. Our prayer motivator quote today is from E.M. Bounds. He said, Our praying, however, needs to be pressed and pursued with an energy that never tires, a persistency which will not be denied, and a courage which never fails. Holy Father God, we pray in the holy name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Lord, we thank you so much today that when we are weak and feeble and it seems as though we don't have enough strength to go on, uh, that we can always call on you, for you have all power and might and strength in your hands. In Jesus Christ, the holy name we pray, and for his sake, amen. Dear friend, if you do not know the Lord Jesus Christ as your personal Savior, the first prayer you need to pray is what we call the sinner's prayer, believing in your heart that Jesus Christ died on the cross for your sins, was buried, and rose again. John 3.16 says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Just believe in your heart that Jesus Christ died for your sins, was buried and rose from the dead by the power of God for you so that you can live forever with him in heaven. Pray and ask him to come into your heart today, and he will save you. Romans 10.13 says, For whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Until next time, my beloved, please remember, pray, think, do. God bless you.